don't forget, if you like these drawing tutorials and want to do more, check out our teacher store. That's right, and a bunch of lessons of how to draw comic books and other animals and all kinds of cool stuff. Check it out in the description. Down below is the link. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I wanted to be a vegetable. <laughs> and now I'm a cryomal. I'm crying. What's up, everybody? <laughs> Welcome to a new cartoon drawing tutorial today. We are cracking, I'm cracking myself up, and now uh, you get to see me cry. We are drawing Cottish from the Octonauts. That's right, the uh, vegetables, which are part vegetable and part fish. So I think Cottish is a codfish and a radish. Not sure, but uh, maybe you guys can comment below. Tell me what you think. <laughs> Not what you it's think. It's vegetables. Veg what did I say? Vegetables. <laughs> That's my always eat your vegetables, kids. All right, so we're gonna turn our papers portrait or up and down, and um, we need we need things to draw with, right? So get your three peas out. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm hearing it. I'm hearing it. <gasps> the new merch is out. That's right. Check out the description below. Check out. Get yourself a new shirt like this or. Get a nice three P shirt. And speaking of three P's, get your three P's out your paper, your pen, and your pencil. Hopefully, you got an eraser as well. And now let's turn our papers portrait and let's get started. All right. <laughs> First, thing we're gonna do is start off with a nice, beautiful circle. Circle. All right. Yeah, we're a little silly here today. That's okay. It's all right. <laughs> Look, my circle's got like a little bump on his head. All right, once we have our circle, we're going to make a nice, beautiful ice cream cone. And the way we're gonna do that is we're going to go from each side of that circle and we're just gonna make a rounded off V. Like that. So it's kind of a small cone, <laughs> a small cone <laughs> shape, not real long. So just kind of, just kind of eyeball it. Just like that. You don't want to make you want to make it smaller than the circle. All right. Once you have that, we're gonna go from each side of that magic cone or the, the V that we made, and we're gonna just gonna make a nice big happy face or a nice smile line, nice smile line, just like that. All right. Once you got your smile line, uh, we're going to do the magic <laughs> secret, artist secret, the magic tea. Magic tea. We haven't done a magic tea for a while, I don't think. Uh, why is the... So let's put a giant big tea right in the center of this circle that we made. Why is the magic tea so magic? Because now that you got the tea on the face, you can know right where the pieces of the face will go. And uh, I'll just let the text show. Read the text. It, it's it's going to say it better than me right now because I'm just all giggles right now. Okay, once you got your magic tea, we're going to do some eyeballs and we're going to use that line that we put across that whole thing. We're just going to make nice, big, large, well, not large, but nice, big, uh, full rainbow lines. Like that. Then right underneath it, really thin, happy, you might need to zoom in, really thin, uh, Smile lines, there we go. <laughs> Smile lines, there we go. All right, now we can erase what's inside those right there. I'm, I'm already, I just like to do the fun stuff. I'm gonna put a little baby circle in there, like that. All right, now let's go to the center of that magic tea that I just messed up. We're gonna just put a little oval, like that. And underneath that oval, we're gonna put a baby V. Boy, you're really gonna have to be zooming in here. And then you can get rid of what's in the middle or right there. Okay. Now we're going to put two ovals on each side using that magic T line. So we got one oval that way. Another oval that way. So the kind of ovals are kind of leaning towards each side. And now we're going to make Cottish really happy. And the way we're going to do that is give him a nice big smile. Let's do that. Yay. Nice big smile. In fact, he's so happy he's going to have two smile lines. So zoom in again. 
-hmm. And right uh, above this one, we're gonna put another smile <laughs> on, just like that. He's so happy. All right, so now we're going to go down here. Let's get his body. We should definitely get his body. So the bottom of his cone, we're gonna make an upside down, uh, like like a, uh, a round V. A round V shape, just like that. And then once you got your round V shape, we're going to just make Stretched out C, or a oval, or uh, I don't know. But we're going to do it on each side. This one's going to point that way. Don't write the arrow. And this one's going to point down this way. Oh, make them even. <laughs> oh, man. Make them even if you can. I'm having troubles today. Is that even? Is that close? Well, I guess... You've got pencils. You should be using your pencils, by the way. <laughs> um, so make them as, as best as you can there. All right. Once you got his cute little legs, we're going to do uh, little baby circles. And they're going to be floating around, floating around, two baby circles, just floating around. And then from that baby circle, we're going to, on one side, shoot a, a curved line going straight up to his body. Same thing on this side, shooting straight up. Kind of going up to this little smiley line there. And then we're going to do the same thing on this side, only this time we are going to go. We're going to kind of go a little wider. So see how your circle is small? Make sure the space between the two lines is larger than the size of the circle. Okay? All right. I'm going to do the same thing here. Like that. Right. So basically, we're making these flippers. All right. Here, I'm going to erase everything. There we go. So if it's easier just to make some flippers, do that. I did this little circle because I thought maybe it'll keep... Uh, I made mean, that was a bad idea. Okay. We're pretty much done with cottage now. <laughs> Can you believe it? Let's erase this line right here. All right. We're going to erase that and that. And we're going to erase that and that. Okay. Now, here comes the hardest part. <sighs> if you got cookies, eat a cookie. If you got something to drink, get something to drink. Because the real work is going to begin. We're going to take that match T line right up to the very top, and we're going to make a little mound, just like that. Once you have your little mound, we're going to shoot on the little curved line like that, going straight off into... It's like a firework. We're going to do another firework. Let's shoot it off. Ready? But this one's going to go the other way. All right, once we got that, we're going to connect those two. And then we're going to make a little circle over here. And then we're going to, once you got your circle, we're actually going to connect that to that line like that. All right, it's going to look kind of strange for a bit. Uh-oh, hold on. Okay, I was running out of room. I was running out of room. Um, and I may need to do... Never done before in the history of this drawing channel, but I have to make some extra room. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Excuse me for a minute. Hopefully the editor will get rid of all this. <laughs> all right, we need some room. It's more, it's ruined. You're not gonna be able to draw right over there because the ink's so smudged. It. Look. It's gonna work. It won't. It's gonna be all. The ink's not gonna show up properly. It's gonna be sort of melting. You're not. You can't. You still can't draw up there unless you. And then there we go. All right. Give me. A, let's let's try it. All right. Now we can. Hopefully you edited all that out. Let's go ahead and draw a heart right in the middle of the top of this thing. This this weird shape we made. We're gonna make a big circle-y shape. Just like that. Right next to it, we're gonna make a little rainbow D shooting off that direction. I know it looks really strange right now, but trust me, it's gonna be cool. All right, <laughs> right at the bottom of this mound, we're gonna do another shooting off uh, hair, <laughs> big hair shooting off to this direction. We're going to make a giant circle like that. And then right here next to the circle, we're going to connect this little rainbow with this circle by making another rainbow like that. All right, on the bottom here, we're gonna make an upside down U or a, a sideways U, and then make a baby ups, uh, sideways U. Okay, 
Does any of that make sense? And hopefully. Now you're gonna race. Not to seeing that. Uh, I'm gonna darken these lines a little bit. All right, we're not done yet. We have one more bit to do. And that is, we're going to, what are we gonna do? Yes, we're going to make a little rainbow shooting off right here on the stem. And it goes like that. And then we're going to make another curb line that goes up to here. In the, okay. <laughs> I didn't know what you were doing. <laughs> My editor's doing something to the camera. I'm not sure what's happening. I don't know. All right. So once you have this curb line, we're going to shoot it up straight up to there, to this circle there. <laughs> once you have these two weird curvy lines, we're going to make another baby U shape or a D or a C or a C. Yeah, we'll see. And then right here next to the C, we're going to make a little baby U, right? Mm -hmm. All right? I'm just making sure you're in frame. I'm not doing anything with the camera. No, I, you're the editor. You're oh, just... it's falling! Just kidding. <laughs> All right, so there you go. There is a... Wow, he's got a, a big... I kind of want to make this a little bit bigger because I feel like this is too small. I. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, so you guys can make this bigger if you want. I'm gonna make this a little bit smaller. All the shapes are the same. I'm just uh, adjusting a little bit. There we go. <laughs> He's got big hair. Is that hair? All right. Anyway, um, this is kind of long too. I'm gonna make this a little bit shorter. <laughs> I made his, his sprout a little bit too big. All right, there we go. Now the fun part. We're going to fill in the eyeballs, just like that. And then we're going to get rid of the magic tea. <laughs> All right, we're getting rid of that magic tea. There he is! Oh, wait, no. <laughs> we're not done. Sorry. I thought we were done. We need to draw four more lines. Okay, we're gonna do a little curve, happy face right there. <laughs> kind of going across his head. Then we're gonna do the same one, a parallel line. A parallel line is a line that follows the path of another line, but never touches. And then we're gonna do a small one right there and a small one right there. Now we're done. There you go, Kaddish. <laughs> Insert yay here. Um, all right, you guys. So that is Kaddish. Uh, ink these in, color them up. Uh, send in your Kaddish to our Facebook page, and we will also post it up here on YouTube. Uh, also, wherever else you may be watching this, we'll be finding ways to post these up there as well. Okay, so apparently I have to pull out another name. <laughs> I guess we're pulling out names for everything now. Uh, we got a lot, and sorry that we are a little delayed. Last week we didn't get a video up. But we're going to have two up this week to make up for it. So we've got Kaddish. And also we pulled out, I believe we pulled out Sandy from the Octonauts. It's an all Octonauts week here. All right. I'm going to, I'm going to pick it. I'm going to pick it. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if we can do this. I'm going to throw it up. Ready? Here we go. I got something. I got something. Okay. Here it is. This is the one. It's Zombo. Zombo. Well, I don't know why I'm doing this voice, but anyways. Well, we looked up what Zombo meant, and it turns out it was just a nickname for a zombie, and we already did a zombie. What should we draw next? Zombo. Uh, Ludi Santos is asking for Zombo. I'll have to look up what Zombo is. <laughs> I hope it's not a zombie. All right. You guys, uh... Uh, so, yeah, next week, or the next one, we will be doing zombie. Uh, what do we do now? I guess we can say goodbye. You guys, keep on drawing. The more you do, the better you get. Oh. want to draw more? Well, we got more videos for you to watch. Check out any of these and please share this with all your friends. Let's get more people drawing. 
the more you draw, the better you get. All right, see you at the next video.